recording again. I tried to turn up the volume, which I thought I had to, which I guess I don't have to. So we'll see how this goes. He, uh, the back fence is almost all the way out. It's, t oh, it is out to the corner. I can see back on the other side of the shed. Um, and those, I'm just watching him work because I just want to see if he just yanks those trees out if they're that dead or you have to go ahead and saw them down. <laughs> wanted to take the, the run the trunks down on the back trees I didn't think about because it's over by the whatever the pond we have back there the stream but we should have probably done it anyhow but that would have been I don't know how much more they want to charge for fucking every time you have anything done it's it's a charge This is my toast. Go away, beggars. That's interesting. He's doing a wheelie. I'm not quite sure what he's doing back there, but if he's not careful, he's going to end up tipping over and going into the ditch. But we'll see. Oh, I think he's he's trying to get out that corner tree back there behind the shed. And he's taking the fence down. You can kind of see working over there. And, uh, yeah, I'm doing pretty good. I didn't want to hold my phone all day, so I got it on a little makeshift stand with my coasters stuck behind it to tip the phone up a little bit more. Uh, You guys need to go potty, because so I'll take you out to the front yard on your leashes. Yeah, I know. The back yard's all tore up. I know, don't Jay? Say hi to everybody. Okay, this is my... Pain in the ass. <laughs> Oops. It's Dolce and Ada, who's on the floor. These are my loves of my life. Well, besides my husband. <laughs> but, as d dog owners, we all try to be responsible for our dogs. And having a fence up was our priority when we first moved in. But replacing the fence will come. We'll have to make sure we take our dogs out and be responsible and have them on leashes and stuff so nothing happens to them. Yeah, but that's going to be a future project because we are going to have to get the estimates and figure it out, like I said on the other video. But to get this going and get the other one removed, I'm glad I went with the tree guys and knew that, you know, they can just rip fence up at the same time. Because, you know, some people are like, oh, that's not what we do, and blah. 
it's like you got to go through one person to get the fence removed, another person to do this, another person to do that, and I'm like, let's just get it all done at the same time. And we would have had to get the fence removed or cut out to get to those back trees because you just can't do it. So um, they could have lifted it and then put it back up, but I'm like, what? No, get rid of it. It's an eyesore. It's not installed properly. It's rotting. I don't know when they put it up, but the house has been here since 2001, so I'm figuring they probably put it up. The neighbors got the neighbors on the right and the neighbors on the left here agreed to it, so she got um, them to contribute. So I'm like, all she had to probably do is pay for the backside. So she got a good deal. Uh, all right, hold on. I'm digressing again. Okay, let's get back to the center of the yard. You know, the best thing about these videos, you cannot tell how dirty my window is. We had rain yes last night, so I mean, we got a whole bunch of spots on the other side right now. And I'm like, it's crystal clear. <laughs> In it, don't say. Uh, the neighbor has um, a decal on the side of his truck and it says Bobcat, so I'm assuming he is a Bobcat dealer or something to do with it, uh, or sells them or whatever. So uh, you see these little these little Bobcats, which they rent and they own and whatever. I'm not sure what this guy does, if he owns this or whatever. It's not my business. I just want the job done correctly, but it'd be interesting to hear because maybe I'll be able to introduce ourselves to our neighbor a little bit and get to know him. He's very quiet, nice guy. Uh, they keep to themselves. It's his wife, daughter, and him, older daughter. Uh, oh, yeah, I got that too. Oh yeah, you see that? He's just picking that up and taking it out of the ground. That's how dead that one was. And there's not any roots attached to that. Do you believe it? I do. Yeah. That was that little one in the corner that looked like it was dying. And there's garbage there too. Take that up. That's a tree stump. Take it up. Watching you. Get that crap because there's ants underneath. And the reason I know that is because I was out there last night. I bumped it around and, uh, oh yeah, there's that tree that fell down. The double tree that's joined. Uh, oh my God, what a nightmare. Yeah, that was my big thing too. I said, you are going to clean all this up. I am not going to have to be hiring somebody after you to come back and fix your mess. And he's like, no, no, no. I'm like, okay. Yeah. Impressed how he just pulled that little tree out, which I knew it was dead. Oh, he's going for the fence now. There we go. See how easy that came down. So. What a job. The fence we're putting in is going to be cemented in, I'm sure. The posts are, because it's going to be over, it's going to be six foot tall, whatever, whatever privacy. And we're going to hire somebody. Pausing. Ada wants to go outside. They're removing. Okay, Ada. This is your photo shot. Oh, yes, it is. Anyhow, they're removing on the side of the house now. Uh, which, oh, he's in the back. Oh, that part of the fence is all gone. I don't know if the corner is over on the right side, but 
Yeah. The dead tree is still back there over there. I'm assuming they're gonna wanna yank it over here if he cleans up and go ahead and cut it up and get rid of it. So, we're going to pause again. I don't know, we could run it. Yeah, my faucet just shut off by itself. Ooh, yeah. I'm not even by it, so that's a little freaky. <laughs> I'm going to put rig it up so you can I can go. I know, I'm a lazy YouTube video or I mean if I got smart I could put it all on my security cameras, but I don't think I have enough memory on them. in the way. I do not want to move my grill. Not doing it. I'm going to put it back up. I'll pause it. 